Okay, today I'm going to show you how to copy your um, iTunes library into an Excel document so you can list your music and print it out if you're a DJ or whatever. And uh, sorry about the wait time, it takes a long, long ass time for me to load my iTunes library because I got like a lot of songs. So, uh, yeah. Well, um,. All you have to do is select one file, or just one. So list, make it so it lists all your music all in one, um, all in one list, and uh, press Control A, and then con hold down the Control key and press C. And then all you do is go to um, Excel. or whatever the um, open office version is of it I think it's a sp open office spreadsheet or something but all you gotta do is just press once you get this open and fully ready just press con hold down the control key and press V and sometimes it works and sometimes it doesn't okay I gotta copy it again uh, copy and then paste. There you go. Now me, because because the format it does it, I just go through and I'll just like delete this and um like the song time. I'll just delete that. But yeah, uh, after that you can open it up to where you can see the uh, just double click on the line between. Some of them are like really really long and they'll shoot that. Uh, They'll shoot your first uh, column way over there. Just scroll down it and find the really long ones. Like uh, this one. That's. I don't know what's up with that, but. Uh, hmm. Oh well. But. Uh, all you gotta do is just that, and then you just drag your. There you go. And this C it would be your um, album titles. Which you don't really need. I just like my music and my uh, artists in this format, so I can just you know put it in a uh, protected plastic sheet and put it in a notebook, so you have all your music cataloged. By the way, if anybody's wondering, I did not get this song. That is something that um, my mom wanted, and I bought it on an 80s mix thing. I don't know. It was it was dumb. I really hate ABBA. Oh, well. Anyways, that's how you do it. And you just save it as your document or whatever, and um, pretty much it. Now, that does read your ID3 tags. So, if you have a song that's not... Uh, that does not have the ID3 formatted right, like these, um, or like this one, where it says the band and then whatever, um, you'll need to go back and actually do the ID3 tags on them because it'll come out looking weird in the Excel file, like that one that I showed you earlier that had the weird 3 on it. Um, there's one, that, or there's one that didn't come out right. So it says 90 Sugar Hill Gang, Rapper's Delight, whatever. But uh, yeah, you gotta have your ID3 tags done. The old iTunes, there used to be an option that said um, export to uh, text, and it did similar to the same thing, but it wasn't as easy as doing this. You'd have to put it to a text file, and then copy the text file over to Excel, and then reformat it and everything. It was a pain in the ass. This is officially the easiest way I found. Once again, all you do is highlight everything. Go to copy, and then you just paste it into uh, the top line at Excel, and it'll list all your music for you. That's it. See you later.